WFNN. Headline News Update. Welcome, folks. We have the Dow Industrials finished up 210. NASDAQ up 74. S&P's up 20. Gold. Gold contract up $5.70, trading at 2426 an ounce. We have silver down 23 cents, $30.92 an ounce. Late sweet crude off 34 cents. $81.87 a barrel, notes and bonds. 10-year note, down six ticks, 111 flat, 30-year off 25 at 119.05 and King Dollar. King Dollar up 125 ticks, trading out at 104.218. Euro 108, yen 157, British pound 129 to one US dollar. Let's get up, take a look at the SPY first, folks. I believe in both the SPY and the Qs, we get a failure on price and volume. We do. Okay. So you get over the highs today in the SPY, 564837 $564.883. Uh, bottom line, we closed at 561.53. The high on Friday was 563 The volume on Friday was $53 million. We did 36 So you get over the high, you close under the high. This is saying we're going back lower. And I suspect the first place we're going to go is last Thursday. And that's 550, 555 on the SPY. We go into the NDX 100. We take a look at the NDX 100, the three Qs, same type of setup inside the Qs. Qs did 30 million shares. Qs didn't make a high. What the Qs did is that they got over the high of Friday. So the Qs, we had come down on 49 million. You go up Friday on 37, you do go up today on 30, you get to 50101, you close at 496, 15, and 499.62 is where the failure on price and volume came in. So that's telling me that tomorrow we go lower. And what's intriguing here is that the, the Qs, that very well could be the highs of the Qs, because the highs of the Qs, let me see something. 503.28, the day before, oh, look at that, the day before is 503.52. So what you have, see on the Qs, you didn't have a high volume high on the Qs. You came off the, the, the highs with volume. Folks, have a great night. Have a safe night. Come back and visit us tomorrow morning, 9 a.m. Great show, folks. Have a great one. Have a safe one.